Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a chatty get ready with me. I am going to be doing my makeup and I will be chatting with you about my life. Just a little life update and we're just going to talk about some random things. So I just felt like it was needed because I haven't done one in a long time. But before we get into this video, I just wanted to share with you guys an item that I will be using. I will be using a mirror and this was sent to me by Easehold. And this is the Easehold Venus Air Trifold Makeup Mirror. This is in the shade black. They have a couple different colors. I believe it's like pink, rose gold, and white, and also black. So I'm gonna read a couple things about this and yeah. So this makeup mirror is equipped with 38 adjustable LED light. Let's open it up. So this is what it looks like. Hello, you see my camera. <laughs> All you have to do is press this button and it, and it will turn on. So it comes with a five times magnification mirror right here, a two times magnification, and a normal mirror. This is the one size magnification, and then these this is as well. It comes with a ten times magnification mirror, and it is perfect for close up makeup like your eyebrows, your mascara, anything on your face, and it's also really good for travel. So this has the 90 degree rotation that goes up and down, at, and then also 180 for left and right rotation. Up a little bit, you can do that, or if you need it like this, you never know, it is perfect, it will stay in place. Any way you need your mirror. It does it. It does have a dual power supply, so you can use batteries. It takes AAA batteries, or you can plug it in, which I will do right now. It just plugs in right on the back, just like this. This mirror also comes with a cloth to clean the mirror, which I thought is great. You can never go wrong with these. The mirror also has a little tray on the bottom, so you could fit your jewelry, some makeup pieces, anything and it is a perfect spot for the cloth. This desk mirror is perfect for on the go if you don't want to use the cord or plug-in or if you're going somewhere that does not have any plug-ins you can obviously use the batteries and it works fine. So to turn it on all you have to do is tap it and it's on. This mirror is honestly perfect. It gives you the best lighting. I really like it. I enjoy it. This is just what I needed for my desk. This mirror costs $29.99. I think it is a really good price. I will have all the information linked down below in the description box. I will have their website linked down below and the Amazon website of this item linked in the description box for you guys if you want to check it out. My overall thoughts on this item is that it is really good. Also for the price, I think it is perfect just in my price range for $29. 99 this does everything it exceeds my expectations i am enjoying it so much and i really like it in the description box i will have this item linked down below and i will also have my final final thoughts after a few days of using this but you guys already know what my thoughts are by now. I love it. So thank you Easehold for sending this to me and letting me review it. Don't forget to check out the links and let's get on to my get ready with me. So I will be using this mirror to do my makeup. Most of this video I will probably be looking this way or I will have the mirror right here. So that is what I am looking into. So if you would like to check out this mirror and possibly purchase it, I will have all the links and info in the description box for you guys to check it out. Thank you Easehold for sending this to me. I really appreciate it. Okay guys, hey, what is up? So I am filming a get ready with me. I haven't talked to you guys, I feel like, in a long time. And yeah, I just got back from our cabin. I, that vlog will be up after this. We'll see where it's at. But there's a vlog coming up. We had to go check on it. We had to go clean it up because no one has mowed in like a few months. So it was very, the grass was outgrown. But today is a busy day because I am filming a bunch of videos. So I need to do my makeup while I have the energy and while I'm um, just ready to do it. So I am going to do my eyebrows and I'm using the mirror right here. Do my eyebrows. Lately, my eyebrows have not been agreeing with me. I did cut them, cut them down so they are not as long as they used to be, which is very frightening. So let me just do my eyebrows real quick. It is getting really hot up here, so I need to get all my videos filmed. 
as fast as I can. Okay, eyebrows are done. I I just used my L'Oreal Brow Stylist Definer, and this is the ultra thin one. Love that one, although the price is going up on it, but it's perfect. So, we just got back from up north. It was really nice. We only stayed the night just so we could check on everything. And yeah, so my voice is feeling a lot better from Faster Horses. It was so fun, but oh my gosh. It rained like the first two days. It rained so bad. It was raining on and off. I mean, it wasn't bad. It's just, it was so muddy. And our campsite was just the worst. It's at the end of one of the rows and people can drive through. Like it's our campsite and then a little walkway where people can drive through. It was just a hot mess. People were falling in the mud because when it rained, the mud just bunched up and the car tracks just made it really huge it was such a mess then we had a girl driving her truck got stuck in the mud right next to our tent literally like 10 inches from our tent not even like four inches from our tent and what do you do when your truck gets stuck you have to push down the pedal and literally get yourself out of there so she did that all right and got sand all over our tent it see in my vlog about it 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 was not okay. So our tent has was muddy the whole weekend. Thankfully, it wasn't muddy on the inside. It stayed dry, which is great. But it's just a little annoying. It was really fun. We saw all the country singers that we wanted to see. I'm going to use my Too Faced Hot Buttered Rum palette. And this is the Vanilla Extra. This very nude color. I'm using this in my project pan, you guys. This color is in my project pan. I'm just trying to get use out of this palette to see if I want to keep it. Uh, I don't really have many palettes, but I do have some. I'm not really a palette girl. Like, I don't wear much eyeshadow, except for, like, colors you can't even see. So I really need to do a declutter. I have makeup palettes that I've had for, like, five years now to really declutter them. But I really like this. It covers my veins, and it makes my... I would not look as bad. Life is just all fine and dandy. I am loving having, uh, being obsessed with books again. I just really like having that content on my channel. I think reading vlogs are so fun to watch. And I think my reading vlogs are actually really funny because a lot of them I'm reading them for the first time and I never know what my um, outcome is gonna be. But yeah, how are you guys doing? How this, How is this year going for you guys? For me, it's going good. Um, I'm feeling a lot better than I was a few weeks ago just because of all that anxiety leading up to this event. Now that it's done, I am back to normal, I guess. Um, I have big plans, big purchase plans that I want to make soon. I'm trying to save up for a car and that wasn't going so well the beginning of the, the, beginning of the year, but there's literally no timeline. When I, whatever you can save is what you can save, you know? So that's what I'm doing. Next, I'm going to use this Nude Sticks Blush in Sweet Peach Peony. I I'm really loving these pink blushes. You guys know. Pink, orangey blushes are my new color. I finally figured out. Took me a long time. I didn't really like blushes for a long time until last year in 2020 when I decided to buy a whole bunch of blushes. Um, and then next I'm going to cover on top and use my elf blush in spiced apple this is so pretty it's a powder blush it's literally the same color but powder form i'm trying to use this up or just get more usage out of, out of this because i love this apricot orange so much um i also love this highlighter for just a one and done eyeshadow it looks really pretty and yeah it stays on all day i really love it so Looking very peachy. Next, I'm going to use my Marc Jacobs bronzer. This I have not used, I feel like, in so long. I've had this for a few years. This was like one of the first bronzers that I bought when I started buying luxury, like luxury makeup. I think I bought this for my 23rd birthday. Yeah, I'm pretty sure, 23rd. Beautiful. Looks good. It still smells so good. I think Marc Jacobs is going out of business. I don't know for sure, but like I'm seeing all their stuff on just heavily discounted. So if you want to pick up that bronzer, 
pick it up now while it's on sale. I think it's more than half off because when I bought it, well, it's usually like 50 something dollars. When I bought it, it was on sale. I bought it during the Sephora sale, so I got it like half off, but definitely pick it up when it's on sale. I'm feeling br pretty bronzy and peachy, loving it. Okay, I'm back. I got my Start Inspired highlighter and I'm just going to highlight my nose. Add it in so it's not too bright. Highlight my cheeks. Just the center where the light shines. I don't really know where to put highlighter, honestly. I kind of just like put it all over the place, but I'm trying to find the best place to put it for on my face. And then this is my Tower 28 lip gloss. And that's it. That's it. A pretty highlight. Oh my gosh, yes. Highlighted bronzy look. This is a very natural eye look. Any girl could do this. This is basically my work makeup. If you guys have not checked out that video, I will link it right up above. It's basically what I just did. I really like natural makeup looks. Um, I didn't put any sunscreen or, or moisturizer on today because my skin is fairly moisturized. I'm starting to sweat, so it's gonna get really oily. It's going to just not look good soon. But this is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick makeup look. I know it wasn't too long. There's not much going on in my life. If you watch my weekly vlogs, you will be caught up. Just wanted to thank you guys so much for watching and thank you guys to all of the new subscribers. I really appreciate you guys. I'm trying to reach my goal of 1,300 subscribers and you guys are just so amazing to me. I really appreciate you guys coming back and staying with me. I also wanted to thank Easehold for sending me this product to review. I think that's it. All the links and information on this mirror will be linked down below. I will see you guys in my next video.